Alongside Steelheads head coach Everett Sheen, will Sheener a 3-1 win on Wednesday night? First off here, your overall thoughts from the win? No, it's good to get two points. Um, you know, after long travel and, and long days there, it's a little bit of a slow start. Uh, but I th thought we found our footing, especially going into the third there, and you know, ultimately got the, got the job done. Yeah, you guys got on the board first for the second straight game. In terms of being a coach, I feel like you were ecstatic after that goal because that was what you want to see on his own entry, isn't it? Yeah, that was uh, picture perfect. I mean, great pass there by uh, Coiner, and you know, I thought he was going to drop it to Reg, who was the, the fourth man in. But yeah, we had filled our lanes well, and it worked out for us. Seems like the last couple of games, you mentioned the first period maybe hasn't been your guys' best, but you really pick it up over those final 40 minutes. But you have been able to get on the board first. So what needs to change here tonight in order to play that first 20 to what you guys want to be at? we got to come ready to go, focused. Um, you know, it's not, not for lack of focus, but I don't think we're directing our energy in the right way. And, you know, the last two games, yeah, we've come out very slow, um, and you can't do that. You got this, especially this time of year, you got to come out fast, ready to go, because um, it's going to be playoff hockey down the stretch here. Both teams experienced a lot of travel heading into Wednesday's game, and we kind of just talked about it. Kind of a little bit of a boring game to say. <laughs> yeah, very. Um, you know, they played a three and three on the weekend, flew back to Utah, bust here. Um, obviously, we flew back from Tulsa. And yeah, it wasn't a very exciting uh, game from a fan's perspective, I imagine, but, you know, we got the two points, like I said, and that's, that's all that matters at the end of the day. Let's look back at the month of February. Obviously, you guys getting back to winning ways after kind of a 500-ish mark in January. 9-1-1 one one during the month of February, which is very impressive, let alone everything that happened in terms of call-ups and players coming in and out. Yeah, that was a big response for us in February. Um, you know, January didn't go the way we'd hoped or the way we started, but for our group to be able to get out of that kind of funk and... Um, you know, turn it around, get back to winning some hockey games is good, and especially with a group, like you said, that's kind of been changing uh, daily. But, you know, the guys are all bought in and working for each other. In terms of the month of February, power play was outstanding, over 40%, and you guys get a big power play goal to eventually lift you guys to victory on Wednesday night with about four minutes left there. Yeah, power play has been tremendous for us, really helping us win some games. Um, you know, and for being as good as we are on the road, it, it'd be nice to see it translate there at home last game. And, you know, our special teams really need to be dialed as we come down the stretch here. Coach, and lastly here, a specialty weekend in terms of the Jaden DeLuca Foundation. Always nice when the Steelheads uh, have these kind of events going on throughout the weekend. It's a very good cause. Um, you know, it's a big issue to face a lot of families. And for us to be able to, to help raise a lot of money through our jersey auction is tremendous. And like I said, it's an outstanding foundation. So to be able to work with them is, is a truly an honor. Awesome. Well, Sheener, as always, we appreciate the time, and uh, best of luck and have some fun tonight. Thanks for having me, Cam.